my channel. It's me, Joy Presley. Now, before we start the video, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. That would be greatly appreciated. So, oh my goodness, it feels great to be back. It feels great to be back, guys. I haven't done one of these videos in a really long time. I know it's been a minute, but we're here now, and we're going to talk about 10 things I should have brought to basic training. These are things that I look back on and I say, man, I wish I would have had that. I wish I would have brought this. But guess what, guys? We're here for this video. And please give this a big thumbs up. And let's just hop right into the video. So 10 things I wish I would have brought to basic training. So number one is I wish I would have brought stamps. Yes, guys, stamps are so expensive at the Military PX. I don't know why. But that is definitely something I should have brought more of. Now, if you haven't already, please go watch my packing list video because that video explains everything you guys need for basic from clothing, from what you guys have to bring for hygiene. Go watch that video. But yes, guys, I wish I would have brought stamps because in basic training, stamps are like gold, guys. Everybody wants a stamp. I remember in basic training, people would actually be like afraid to even like mail out a letter because once you run out of stamps that's it you have to spend a lot of money at the px the stamps are like 12 dollars. so yes that is something i wish i would have brought more of i should have definitely stocked up on some stamp books you can definitely order them off of amazon and yes guys i should have brought some stamps because you have to remember in basic training mailing letters is the only way you guys can talk to your family members and friends so yes guys bring lots of stamps before you guys ship off to basic so number two is I should have brought some moleskin. Now you guys are probably wondering, you know, what the heck is that? So basically moleskin is like a bandage that you guys will wrap around your toes. You could even wrap it around your fingers in case you guys get blisters in basic training. And you guys will do things called the forge, the anvil, things like that. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, don't worry, I will have a video coming very soon. But yes, guys, you guys will do a lot of rock marching. Keep that in mind. Rock marching will mess up your feet. You will get blisters, but mole skin is there to help you. A lot of people who do ballet also use mole skin. It's a way to protect your feet. So that is something that I should have brought to basic training. I definitely should have went on Amazon and ordered that. So number three for the things I should have brought to basic training is I wish I would have brought more sugar-free cough drops. Now you're probably wondering, you know, why do you need that? So basically, in basic training, you guys cannot eat candy. You guys are not allowed to bring in candy or you guys are not allowed to buy candy when they take you to the PX. So basically, the only thing that they will let you have is sugar-free cough drops because it is harmless. You guys can't really like overdose on that. It's completely, you know, fine. So yes, guys, in basic training, we were eating those things like candy. It was kind of crazy, but I should have brought more sugar-free cough drops especially the cherry flavor the lemon one is kind of nasty but in basic training you guys are desperate if you guys don't know what i'm talking about you guys will definitely experience that in basic you're gonna crave cough drops because it's your only form of candy so yes guys so number four is i wish i would have brought some sewing thread now you're probably wondering what is that for again so in basic training a lot of us needed our eyebrows done right and of course, you know, we can't just go to the beauty salon and get them done. We can't go to a spa. It's basic training. But there was actually one girl who knew how to do eyebrows really well. She was Arab and what she would do is she actually brought with her some sewing thread. It happened to be in her book bag and she literally was charging people money to do her to do their eyebrows basically. So looking back, I wish I would have brought a lot of sewing thread because I do know how to do eyebrows. But basically, I would definitely bring sewing thread if you don't want to look busted. Now, I'm not saying you could bring nail polish. That's not authorized. You can't bring you know things like that to enhance your look you can't bring makeup to basic training but there's nothing wrong with bringing sewing thread especially if you want to keep your eyebrows looking neat just a quick tip but that is something i definitely wish i would have brought i was looking at her like wow and basically when we got out of basic training she pretty much had everybody cash up her and she made over a thousand dollars off of eyebrows for three months so yes guys so that was a mouthful. So number five is I wish I would have bought band-aids, of course. Now in basic training, you know, the drill sergeants will allow you guys to go to sick call if you ever get hurt, of course. But sometimes you would get those little cuts that they're gonna look at and they're gonna be like, oh no, you don't need to go to the doctor for that. Cause there was a lot of times where I scraped my knee 
and the drill sergeants were like, oh no, the cut is not that big. But I wish I would have brought some band-aids just to cover up those small little accidents, you know what I mean? Like they'll let you go, but if they see something like completely small, they won't probably let you go. But I kind of wish I would have had like my own little first aid kit just for those little nicks and scrapes like that. When you guys go for ruck marching, when you guys are in the field, you guys might get hurt just a little bit. But it's also good to bring a couple of extra band-aids just in case those things happen. So number six is I wish I would have brought Vaseline because yes guys, in basic training I went during January, it was very cold and my lips were always chapped. And that is something I hate. I hate having chapped lips. You're not allowed to bring lipstick and lip gloss, but they will allow you to bring CarMax and Vaseline. That is completely authorized, it's completely safe. So I wish I would have brought that. And number seven is I wish I would have brought a small sketch pad to basic training. Yes, now you guys are not allowed to bring like magazines or anything like that, newspapers, books, but you guys are allowed to bring like a small book with blank pages. That is completely fine. There's nothing in there. And when I say small sketch pad, guys, I'm not talking about that huge, you know, Picasso book. I'm talking about a small little something that I can use to just sketch. Sometimes in basic training, I'll be so bored, guys. I would just be like laying in my bed sometimes or sometimes they would like let us come inside and I would have nothing to do. A lot of me and my battle buddies, we had nothing to do sometimes. Only those rare occasions. You're always doing something in basic, but I wish I would have had just a small sketch pad just to draw or keep myself busy and stuff like that. So number eight, I wish I would have brought hair oil. Oh my goodness, guys. So yes, in basic training, if you are a female of color, whatever, they don't have the best products at the PX. I'm just keeping it real. They don't have the best products for kinky, curly, wavy, 3C, 4A, 4C hair. They really don't. I'm going to make a video about that as well. They really don't have the best products. So I wish I would have brought some hair oil because my hair was always dry, guys. It was always dry. I went in the middle of winter so yes i wish i would have brought a small bottle of hair oil now when it comes to you know products for natural hair whatever curly hair you don't want to bring big bottles because that's just too big and it's going to weigh your bag down but i wish i would have brought like a small bottle of hair oil and what you should do is if you're going to bring it make sure you put it in a ziploc bag so that it doesn't spill all over your documents that's a huge no-no. Put that in a Ziploc bag, double it up if you have to. But yes, I wish I would've brought a small little baby size of hair oil. And all these things that I'm mentioning, guys, make sure you guys get the small size when it comes to like Band-Aids and Vaseline. Don't get the big Vaseline, get the small sizes, travel size to make your life a lot easier. So the next thing is number nine. So I wish I would've brought some hand warmers because I went in the middle of winter and my hands were always freezing, guys. So before you guys ship off to basic, if you are gonna be going during you know, the winter season, stock up on some hand warmers because you guys will be outside a lot. Like 98% of the time, you guys are gonna always be outside at the range. I wish I would've brought hand warmers, guys. And number 10 for the last thing, that I wish I should have brought to basic training is a small calendar. Now, I know I mentioned in my other video that you don't really wanna count the days cause it's gonna make your experience slower. But I mean, I kinda do wish I had like a little pocket sized calendar just to write down what we did every day, just to keep myself a little bit more organized because I was losing track of days in basic training, guys. It gets extremely overwhelming. But that is pretty much the end of the video, guys. That is 10 things I wish I would've brought to basic training. I hope you guys like this video. I hope you guys learned something and please leave me down some comments. Tell me what you guys want to see next. I love you guys so much. Peace.